Hello, I'm Benny Bristow with today's spiritual meditation, Where to Walk. A welfare worker found a crippled boy in a poverty-stricken section of the city. She took great interest in the boy and longed to see him walk and be a boy among boys. She decided to consult a famous orthopedic surgeon who agreed to help. Examination was made and an operation was performed. Slow and tedious days of recovery proved the operation a success. Gradually the child could walk, then run, then play. He was a boy among boys. In telling her story, the welfare worker paused to say, He is now a grown man, and I want you to guess where he is and what he is doing. There were several guesses. He is now a doctor, or he is a great humanitarian, a minister. Is he a welfare worker? No, you are all wrong. He is in San Quentin serving a life sentence for murder. Then she continued, We spent all of our time teaching him how to walk, but failed to teach him where to walk. The story points up one of our greater challenges in this life, that of teaching ourselves and our youth where to walk and how to build lives for God. This can be done not by seeking only physical needs, but by putting spiritual things first. There are those who boast that America has has grown, the old idea of purity and good morals. But what they're really saying is that millions have left the teaching of God's word. What is the fruit that America is harvesting by putting off the moral teaching of the Bible? Prisons are filled. Divorce rate is skyrocketing to an all-time high. Acts of sexual impurities are practiced without guilt or shame. And crime grows daily. Don't you think it's time for us to consider the importance of where to walk? It is so important that we become and are faithful Christians and walk as the Lord commands. And that's today's spiritual meditation. Thank you.